Hello one and all, welcome back to the Burgundians campaign in Attila Total War. My name is Ben Pope. On Ben Pope Games, we are sieging Hrefnesholt. The poor Geats, they have uh, waged war against our brethren around, although they're also closely related in some ways. Um, they actually damaged the Danes uh, and... Uh, the Danes are no more because the Saxons came in and took them out. I'm in somewhat friendly... Eh, with almost anyone, really, almost everybody here. The Saxon... I'm, I'm trading with a lot of these guys. And uh, we're gonna take out the Geats, but not destroy them. We're gonna make them our Strappy or Client State. We'll see which one. Uh, I have the All Options Unlocked mod. Made by Dresden, you find that in... Uh, on the team... Steam's workshop and also there's a description in my video below. So we have an army of... Let's see here, we have five levy spears, Germanic warbands, three. We have the scattershot hurlers, barbed javelin, one mounted warband, supported by a couple more spears, a Germanic warband, more scattershot and javelinmen. That's what the Burgundians are good for, the Barb, Javelinmen, and the Scattershot Hurlers. They just do a lot of damage. Uh, I think we have... We have Battering Rams and Ladders. Uh, we're not going to waste waste more time. They have... Uh, mercenaries. Let's see, boats there. Uh, they have decent, decent things going on. I wonder if I can bring... I'm sorry, that's not the button I want. I want to <laughs> continue siege. And I want to see how far my boats are. Uh, they're pretty far away. I don't really want to wait for them. Because those guys are sort of protecting. And these guys could reach. But then I don't know if, I don't know if that's smart. I think it's smarter to have... Um, all the boats having to come ashore and, and fight us. Uh, the numbers on the soldiers on the boat are not that great. So, um, if I bring these guys in, I risk I risk losing them. So, let's just go fight the good fight. And kick some arse and take some names. It's the Wolves of War versus the Icicle of Blood, the two leading armies. Then we have the Storms of Blood, I should change that name. Sails of the Moon and the Garrison Army and Fleet. Number-wise, we're probably fairly equal. It is dry conditions, so we're going to start deployment. Damage done on the campaign map will be visible on the battlefield. It takes time and money to repair it, something the besieged can ill afford. A direct assault on a province capital without artillery or siege equipment is only possible after allowing a siege to escalate. All right, so I've. In the settlement walls through which I think I'm just gonna go and climb up on this wall here. Um. There's not very many, there's not like unpassable terrain, it's just roads and stuff. So we're going to come up here, possibly take out this tower, and then go capture, fight everyone. And we'll have to watch out for boats coming from behind us, stuff like that. Uh, our, would you believe that our... Um, Reinforcing army, although it although they were right behind us, as far as placement on the map, they're spawning way on this side of the map. So that uh, that's kind of unfair. I placed those guys behind me because I thought, hey, this is where I want them. This is where I need. Um, okay, these guys are on ladders. Uh, you guys don't really need the battering rams, but why don't we put the battering rams? We'll place the battering ram over here. I'm gonna drop it. 
uh, same with this one place it over here and drop it and our secondary army coming in they can grab those okay, I need to click there because that's just slow all right so you guys are back here um, so we toss it our warband let's do yeah let's let's do okay you guys you guys need to grab that ladder okay and then come back Alright, so these guys are going to take a while to travel across, huh? So we probably should do... Nope. We'll just do that. We'll just leave them there. Okay, so you guys are first... First row in. Then, um... You don't need to be locked. Okay, and you guys... You guys will support there and you guys will support here and then we have our general and right okay yeah yeah I know they're coming Okay, and then the last one. Probably over there. Oh, that was you. Which one is this guy? This guy. Uh, yeah. Alright. Hurlers. Go in. Let's go over here for these guys. Really quick, grab everyone and come to the spot. And I'll check with you guys in a little bit. That'll be the second force coming in. Those boats are probably gonna come across and try to get us on the shore. Um. Let's put these guys over here. Right, need to speed up a little bit, otherwise we'll be sitting here forever. Uh, looks like the bloody forest is on fire. Um, hopefully that doesn't damage our... It might, you know, it might catch our lighters on fire. Uh, so if you guys can move faster, that would be great, please. Um... Our scatter shots are doing a number on these guys, I think. I think. Our men have given up and are running for their lives. Oh, are you serious? Hmm. All right. Well, that's not good. All right. Let's let's turn these guys around. Uh, you guys should grab. Stop doing that. Stop fleeing in the madness. Alright. This is not enough. Um, not, 
Not enough. Alright. How can you possibly... You possibly assist these guys, okay. Go in there. These guys coming ashore? They're not. Alright, so we can support with these guys now. I don't... Don't know why these guys are back here. Okay, come on in. Can we uh, shoot at this really quick? No, not you, man. That's not. You guys can you shoot. Can't shoot. We're really not doing very well on this side, are we? Nobody's climbing ashore here, so I'm gonna bring my uh, no. Bring our cab out here. Switch, switch, switch. So you guys need to capture this, please. Uh, over here. General's going in. No, we got this. We just need to get these guys in freaking faster somehow. Come on. An entire unit has perished. There we go. Perish. Fight over here, guy. Fight over here. You guys fired the ammunition? No. Fire over there. Nope. Alright, let's see some fireworks, people. Come on. No, no fireworks. Too bad. Are you taking down that door yet, my friend? Apparently, we are through the gate, uh, so let's go. Are we still holding on to the ram? Right. Come on, boys! Come on! Come on, boys! Toss some jabs. There we go. Ooh. 
Ouch. Alright, that's probably enough. Uh, he probably should just fire over there. Let's go capture that. Onward! Uh, we're gonna go for that spot. And you guys... You guys can actually all come out over here. Let's go a little faster. All those boats have been uh, doing something but they just haven't landed to attack us. Uh, which is giving us sort of free free roaming um, yeah. A unit is running from the enemy. I don't know who's running but why don't we stay? Why don't we what are we? No. You guys don't have any ammo, do you? The enemy has killed our general. What? Okay, dudes, that's that's great. You know, killed my general just for like just like that. Look at this. One unit of stupidity has destroyed everybody here. That is retarded. Heavy marauders. All right, let's do. Precision shot coming around the corner. No. That's not that's not destroying them all. Sweet, thank you. Alright, now we can go. And we're just gonna go for this hill up here, guys. And uh, everyone else, where are you? Jeez. I'm not sure if I'll need him, but um, maybe. All right, so our hurlers and javelin men need to fire on this guy. And everybody else over here. Okay, we're gonna sort of watch this and hope that it's good. Come on, hurl your stuff. Who's used up the ammunition? Alright, you can go over here. Uh, you and you and you. Close up. Closer in, closer in. Come on, come on, come on. Gotcha. 
Let me go. Oh, come on. You gotta kill better than that. I mean, I'm sort of shooting uphill, but not really. It's point blank shots. Come on. Oh, this is retarded. Should have captured this. They're eventually gonna die. Um, half their strength is up. Yay! This has gone terrible, but um, we should still be able to win it, I'm guessing. These guys are not dying though. The men are broken and running for their lives. Really? I lost it. Yay! A unit has fired all of its ammunition. Spears ready. Okay. You come out here, you're useless right now. Should have gone in there before. Why don't we look at some epic fighting? It's like a good idea, bad idea sort of thing, but... Horse unit was just like, hey, cool. Um, all I have is this javelin man, so we're gonna bring him out here. I should be. Should be able to capture this point here really quick. Warriors, 
Frenzy! Okay, you guys were supposed to like go crazy when I hit Frenzy. Victory! Alright. Well, there we have it, folks. Uh, that was a bad fight on my part. I don't know why it went the way it went, but um, it was sending in sending in a general against that other unit, and he just gets killed like that. Um, and that unit, mind you, their general was dead, so um, that freaking unit should have been like weak. But no, the PC gets, you know, they they get good good bonus points. Um, Okay, so I can subjugate, and that will make them um, client state of, or whatever, and it'll enslave the captives. Um, I really don't want to have to sit up here and um, occupy it. So, do that. This faction has now become your tributary state, or puppet state. Taking advantage of your military might in exchange for a percentage of their income, and in the case of puppet states, unlimited military access. However, puppet states may find themselves dragged into a conflict not of their own design. Unlike a regular ally, they cannot decline. All right, so we're gonna get uh, this general Gizzle her to replace our other general, which was a faction leader. So it kind of sucks. Um, this makes um, this makes the Geats friendly and improving. They're um, gonna give us tribute, and we have military access, and eventually we can trade. And, and um, so quick with your yeah, so we'll look to trade with them again. They should have left us. Um, you know, left us be at the beginning, but they decided to declare war. So that actually kind of concludes my episode for today. The Geats and us are on friendly terms again uh, because we took their city and subjugated them, uh, made him, made them a puppet state. So puppet states have allies. Uh, they can start a war. They have allies of their own and enemies of their own. Uh, they also send you some of money, so they do their own thing. They, they just go around, um, you know, capturing things, doing whatever. They just have to pay us. Yeah, they d oh they can't start they can't start a war. They just have to fight the wars I have, which is cool. I can start wars with people, and they can go around and do that sort of thing. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Actually, let's end the third turn. Um, since, since we can, why don't we make him, uh, uh, yeah, we'll go infantry commander. Is it really going to tell us? I don't know what happened there. It told us that the Geats lost the general. Well, of course they lost the general. We killed it. Him. Would have been nice to have that land for myself too, but I, that's not my intention in this campaign. I don't need to subjugate like-minded German tribes if I don't have to. I don't need to uh, destroy them and take their land. Subjugating seems to be okay. Uh, I think we're going to have to keep our armies up there because the Rugians have decided to land uh, their horde. The Rugians. Alright, so we have captured an old man spying on our troops. He has already admitted his guilt. What should we done with him? Engage in faction politics. Deal with it. Okay, so we'll deal with that l in the next episode. Our troops are replenishing here, and that's fine. We're probably going to combine this, these two forces. Um, yeah, and defend against that, which is most likely coming... 
up that way and the, the dragon slayers but i don't think we have any dragons um our fleet here can probably go after their fleet we just have to trick them into thinking that that they're safe um and we'll give the rugans a good beating possibly next episode so please do turn tune in again and until then uh i appreciate any support you can provide commenting liking sharing out with with your friends um, showing people how bad I fight at sieges stuff like that I appreciate all of it and I will see you hopefully soon enough bye